after my uh, last video regarding uh, the bulbs from uh, Philips Extreme Vision plus 130 percent I thought uh, I owe you guys a much higher quality video so um, I will try to make up in this one to make up for it um, as you can see on uh, your right there's uh, the bulb from Philips Extreme Vision plus 130 percent that I have installed on uh, my low beams and on the left side of the image is uh, the first generation of Extreme Vision plus 100 percent the main difference between these two is that uh, the newer bulb has an extra blue stripe in the middle compared to the uh, old generation the Philips Extreme Vision 130% 100% so uh, that's why uh, the new ones are uh, brighter have uh, 3700 Kelvin color temperature compared to the 3350 Kelvin that uh, the previous generation had the beam length and uh, the lifespan are um, the same um, with uh, 45 meters longer than uh, the one of a standard bulb and um, 450 hours uh, lifespan as you can see during the daytime um, the Philips Extreme Vision bulbs uh, don't seem like uh, much the color is uh, yellow which has a yellow tint to it and um, they uh, look like just uh, just like uh, your average uh, bulb a standard bulb but um, during the night time it's a uh, whole different story This is how the bulbs from uh, Philips Extreme Vision plus 130% look like during the night time. I will uh, turn on the fog lamps with Blue Vision Ultra so you can have a better idea of the difference between uh, the color temperature. Right now the fog lamps are on also and the low beams. they are almost identical if um, the previous generation the Philips Extreme Vision plus 100% um, appeared not so bright in uh, the color temperature as the fog lamps uh, these uh, 
new bulbs the 130 percent really uh, I don't know uh, exactly how the camera uh, films it but even with the bare eye uh, I can't tell a difference and the fog lamps I, rem uh, I remind you have uh, 4000 Kelvin color temperature May I remind you, I have uh, Philips Extreme Vision 130% on the low beams and Philips Extreme Vision 100%, the old generation of bulbs, on the high beams. I will first drive for a short period of time using only the low beams so you can have a better idea of how these uh, bulbs light up the road during uh, normal conditions and after that I will uh, switch on the high beams as often as possible.
look like during the day and the night. Thank you for watching. Take care.